you today um my name is joy fido and i'm doing this video from world of breeding and extensions um you know we have so many um different areas of our business now but at different times i represent different roles and this role is from the world of breeding and extensions part of our business but it's all about the hair extensions um We've got something new now we call the choice hair and choice hair is about the various hairstyles that each of us choose to have. I'm a big one for that. Um, if you've been watching our videos you would know I never have one hairstyle and people always say but you're always changing your hairstyle what do you do? Sometimes people think it's a weave sometimes okay i wear the braids as well once in a while but it's been a long time i wore braids not because i don't love to wear braids but because i'm just so busy and don't have time for that so what i decided to do with my hair and i'm actually in the process of trying to lock it so that it just doesn't give me that too much trouble of worrying about how to style it but of course i love my wigs that's the honest truth i love my wigs I mean, and then somebody was chatting with me why I said they're just like dresses to me so whenever I put on a dress I'm thinking what hair should go with that dress and that has been me all along so this is why sometimes I wonder why people go and damage their own hair because if you can just wear a unit your hair will be saved and whenever you feel like shaving off your hair you sure it why don't you have to destroy it and get into this process of my hair is damaged my hair is not growing what should I do I get that all the time and so I am giving you my secret today my secret is I wear different hair units constantly why is a thing of fashion I call them hair fashion hair fashion is in look at Beyonce look at Rihanna look at Ritara everyone is wearing one unit or the other to suit what they are doing at that point in time and so this video is about guiding you on how to take care of your curly hair unit which is a signature tone of mine and so I love curly hair um, sometimes you see me wear like the really kinky curls the ringlets and everything curly Okay, occasionally you're going to see the straight hair on me, which again I'll do a video to show you how I go about it. But this particular video, I want to show you how I treat my curly hair units. And then, if you want to have this hair, just feel free. We'll put all our details in the description box and let me know and I'll get them for you. I, I mean, I'm, I'm at that stage now where I really want to focus on the units. Because all these years my focus has been I want to train people, I want to empower everyone so you can go home and make money and feed your family and take care of yourself. It's not that I don't want to do that anymore. That will still be there for people who really need me. But I'm going to now focus on women who want to look good like me. I love looking good. I mean, look at me. I, I love what I see in the mirror and I thank God for it. Because there's so many people who did not get to the age that I am now. I'm nearly 52 and I love my look so the message is take care of yourself and take care of what you look like if you love to look good I love to look good and that's why I'm here showing you this video so that if you're with that frame of mind like I have do the things you need to do to look the part so here we go so this is a unit it's a virgin hair unit and my love for wavy hair is I don't have to do anything that's the biggest love for wavy hair so I'm gonna take this off and so that's me and my wig cap and I'll just give you a little hint of what my hair looks like see the hair I'm trying to lock it but I've not had the time to really really get it fully in the way I want it to be so it's nicely tucked in in my wig cap and of course when I get home I take it off and I release my hair so wig cap done there's gonna be series of videos on how to work with the wigs 
And so this particular unit is a virgin hair unit. And you see that is a frontal. So all of the front has got the lace on it. I've been having people calling me, they want to train in this and they want to train in that because everyone just want quick action, right? They don't want to take their time to understand anything. And then of course at the back is the wig cap itself. And so, that's the hair. So the trick I want to show you today, if you are into units, the biggest thing you do with wavy hair is just use your hand to release the curls. Use your hands to release the curls. If you find any curl is getting tangled, release it. Release it. And what I do is take it upside down. So this is the front and this is the back. And so I just turn it upside down and this is what I've done. I'm kind of pushing it forward. So I'm letting the waves go forward. And you see why I'm doing this. So then I take my time and finger comb them, finger comb them. So going to each of the strands, whichever one's looking too curly or not a kind of like is stuck to each other. You're not releasing everything, but just a few. See that? So you kind of detangle them with your fingers. No brush, never use a brush on curly or wavy hair. I get this question all the time. People want to know how do you care for your wavy hair? They look so nice, they look so alive. My none of my wig dies. I just get tired with them and I throw them away if if they are not very good quality hair. Which yes, I used to have synthetic hair in the past, but now I've gradually moved on like everybody does. So now I'm working with virgin hair. So you 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 can still get really good units with synthetic hair. It's up to you. Yeah. But this one is a virgin hair piece. And then in there is my elastic band. So that absolutely helps to hold the lace part in place. So if you do have a unit right now and you're struggling to get them to hold, feel free, send them to me and I'll put it in. This is what all my friends have done over time. And they find a big difference. So anyway, we finger comb this hair to our happiness, to our satisfaction. And then it's time to wear it. So this is going to be a really short video just showing you how I put this on and how I care for it. That's the front, that's the back. So what goes in first is the band. Then you leave the rest of the hair, push it in. Take that comb, which I probably didn't show you earlier, there's a comb here, and you tuck it in. Voila! So you see when I pushed it forward and was detangling it, what I was doing is to give it that fullness. That fullness. So for me, I love that Dana Ross look. I mean, you're going to see so many different types that I'm going to be wearing um, from time to time to show you how I care for them. So again, I come back here and I just take my time to still detangle them. And if I wasn't happy with the front, I just take my time and push it in place. See that? And it's all in place. And so, go that way, go that way. Now the good thing with the, um, what did we call it? The front hole is you can open anywhere and say, yeah, I want this side to be the point that I open. You go like that. But of course, if you really want it to be completely open, you can take a comb and actually help yourself to make it very clear. But that's the beauty of the frontal. You can just, you can choose wherever you want. And you know, I'm sure you've heard about this baby hair thing. See all of those little, little hairs. You can take a little bit of gel and hold them down. But I'm not, I don't like that. My, my young daughter does that. You should see when she does her, 
her um her baby hair they look so perfect i love it but it's not me i love the natural look like oh look you got hair everywhere i love that so that's me and that's um just a quick guide on how to take care of your wavy hair unit and how to wear your units so of course like we've said take your time look after yourself look good to feel good and we got these units in stock if you do like them all you have to do is tell us what colors you're looking for and we'll send them to you so thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video god bless you